Hey everyone, I have a little bitty penny haul from the last day of the clearance event. So if you are interested in seeing maybe some old pennies or items that have been pennied for a while, then this is a video for you. So let's jump right into it. So these apparently have been sitting at my local store for a very long time on a top shelf. And I just recently paid attention to like the bottom how it's like curved right here. And as soon as I saw a stack of these, I was like, I know what those are. Pulled them down, sure enough, it was a whole stack of these frozen activity backpacks and the Trolls activity backpacks. So I'm going to go around town and put these in little free libraries. Here's your UPC for that. And they do come with some cute stickers. So maybe if you have like your grandkids or anyone stopping over the summer, you wanna have like little things for them to do. This is a cheap way to have some activities. Here is the Frozen. All right, so we got quite a few of those. I'm gonna be driving around for a while putting those in the little free libraries. <laughs> um, I found one of these. And how I found this is I was just cleaning up the summer aisle uh, at my local store. Like it was torn up. I don't know why people do this, but I just took an extra like 15 minutes and I straightened out the whole aisle. And as I was just picking up pools and you know organizing them and stuff, this was under a whole bunch of just random like floaties. I don't know how it got there, but I'm grateful. It is still a penny as of right now, um, but Christie's Connections did say these are starting to reset. So just be very careful. Make sure you scan because it could reset by the time you find it. All right. So remember how I told you those like gray totes are our friend during the clearance event? Here's why. Mostly all this stuff I got out of the gray totes. Some of it was actually just down the clearance aisle at a store I had never been to before. So I found this Schmitz Charcoal Magnesium Deodorant, and it was a penny. The Tom's Mountain Spring, I got two of these. This is, I just scanned it, even though it's yellow dot. Um, I'm thinking this might be before 2020, and that's why it's still a penny. Because if it was after 2020, yellow dot and all that stuff resets now. So where it used to go to a penny and stay a penny forever, nowadays it goes to a penny for a month or so, maybe a couple weeks, and then it goes back to full price, which stinks. So that's why I'm thinking this little llama is definitely 2020 or prior. Um, because it is a penny. But if you see this in your store, make sure you scan because this is probably going to be a full price everywhere else. Somehow this little guy got missed and put into a clearance tote for years. <laughs> All right. My other exciting find, because we're always needing them, band-aids. Um, these were also a penny and that was exciting to me. Because Next Care are like the best band-aids. I love the fabric ones. Well, if you can even see all that. All right, y'all. The next thing we're going to look at is the pawns. I found a whole bunch of these. I think I found seven. Yep. <laughs> and your UPC is right here. These were just in the clearance aisle in some clearance little boxes. So um, I don't, this was at a store I've never been to. So that's how I found those. A 
And I got two of these pawns. Rejuvenating. No. <laughs> pawns. <laughs> Rejuvenesce. It's fancy. There's your UPC on that. I don't know if they expire, if they haven't been open to the air yet. Um, I don't see an expiration anywhere on those, so I'm not sure about that. Maybelline Fit Me. This is a penny. The Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. That one's got a tiny little barcode on it. All right, so I was digging through the totes and I found a whole bunch of the Wet n Wild makeup sticks. This is Ready, Set, Go. And it's like a bronze-ish color. All right, let's get your UPC right there. Okay. So this just went, I think, with, I guess, the second round of clearance clean out. So if you saw these at a store and they were still full price, I would go back and check because now it is following. I remember these, I kept getting confused with the chocolate cheat day color. Okay, this one is Royal Scam. It's like a dark purple color. And I think I got two of those. This is that Burning Bridges again. I got two of the lighter, like, lilac colors. Lavender Bliss is what it's called. There's your UPC on that. Dude, Eric, please quit. I, he's sitting with me on the bed, just licking himself inside a Dollar General bag, and he keeps kicking me and moving my elbow so that the camera shakes. <laughs> Little ding dong. Um, let's stay with these. I found a whole bunch of the blue ones as well. Uh, these are a little bit darker than these. Let's get the UPC on that bad boy. That color is Not So Calm Waters. Got four of those. Then we got two of these, like, deep blue color. What is it called? Blue La La. found one of the LA Colors Moisturizing Lip Gloss. I think this is Bear. That's the color. Yes, it is. I found one of the lipsticks. Be careful, though, because some of these in the bin are full price. So don't just assume, like I did, because thankfully I scanned it and I was like, oh, holy crap, that's not a clearance item, or it's not a penny. We got the Believe Beauty Nail Polish in Serene. And this is like a really pretty like sage green color. There are some other ones that are still full price, but I'm hoping that they go down. I believe there's one called like Ready, Set, Go or something. Maybe, I don't know, but it's, it's still full price. <clears throat> Let's keep going with the makeup, I suppose. I found one of the Maybelline Define Lash Mascara. I swore the last couple times I scanned these, they were full price, but I just decided to scan it and it was a penny. And we got this red gel liner from Wet n Wild. Lip liner. Then we've got this other lip pencil. little four pack, five pack, my bad, of Wet n Wild um, eyeshadow. All pennies. All this is pennies. 
another Wet n Wild concealer. Pro Partial. This is toothpaste. I found this. I think this went with the clearance clean out stuff. Um, I had never seen this in any of my stores before. I was just scanning it to see if it attached to the Pantene for the clearance event. Well, nope, it didn't attach. It was a penny. But I mean, it'd be cool if it attached because then I would have got probably overage or got it for free. But whatever, I'll still pay a penny and be happy. So I was really excited about that. One of the Penny Lotions, Moonlight Passion. I think this is supposed to smell like Moonlit Path by Bath & Body Works, but it really doesn't. Um, I don't know. And this face mask. I had never seen these before either, and I just decided to scan it because it was in the clearance bin. And it was a penny, so that was super exciting. Alright y'all, well that is all I have for right now. I might go out a little bit later today or tomorrow, see if I can find any other penny items before things start resetting. All right, I will talk to y'all later, and Duder says goodbye also. Bye, guys.